We all just sleep in, in uh, Peebus's hat. Uh, so equipment. Optimal. 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 Now we'll give this little a big old save here. Make sure you rotate your saves, kids. And into the marsh cave we go. Oh, you hear that spooky shit? All right, now let's see if I remember my way around this cave, because boy, did I spend some fucking time in this cave recently. Semi-recently. Pretty recently. Oh shit, this is a good remix. Oh no, I already forget. There's three There's three rooms down here. And I, oh wait, no, I think I remember now. Oh my god, it's Zambambis! Oh Jesus. But luckily we have a thing for this. So, the cool thing about Undead in this game um, is... Oh my god, are you for real? Okay, well... Do I have a thing for that? I don't even remember if I have a thing for that. Or if you de-paralyze after battles. I don't remember, honestly. So, Daya is a spell that only affects undead, but it affects them a lot. Um, and uh, you can also hurt zombies by curing them. If you use cure on an undead enemy, it actually does like the appropriate amount of health, but like in reverse. Okay, so yeah, par paralysis cures after a battle. So you don't need an item for it. Chesto, a broadsword. Hell yeah, dude. Is that is that better for anybody? Yeah. There we go. All right, cool, cool, cool. That's good. That's good. And I'll save just because we got that. I'll save in the same spot. Rotate your saves unless you don't feel like it, kids. Okay. Moving on. So we're gonna go over here. All right, so this is where I kind of lose it and forget a little bit. Man. Gargoyles. Uh. I can't remember what they don't like. I forget what they're allergic to. I want to say Blizzard. Jesus Christ. That was the white mage who did that? Oh, Shirko? 59. Wow, still alive, huh? So bulky guys here. 67, that looks like a... That looks like a weakness to me. I don't know about you. I'm gonna hit that guy, hit this guy. Only 12 that time. It must have been a crit before. Blizzard. Dead. Shit, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Yeah. Success! Phoenix down, there we go. Justifying my not purchasing of it earlier. And I know there's a lot of stuff down here, and I know you're supposed to explore this whole thing, but like, there's a lot of enemies down here. You see that bullshit? There's already an empty chest over there. I got a cottage. In a cottage she's cottage. Between the make-believe trees. All right, here we go. Look at these cool dudes, the Psycho Demons. Psycho Demon. Oh man. So these guys in the original game would spawn in like random numbers. Um, and so you like the first time I walked up here, there was like a couple of them. Or no, the first time I walked up to this in the in the NES version, there was like six of them. And then um, I died and I came back and there was like two of them. So. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to silence them because they are casters for sure and you can see that they do a lot of damage Please hit please hit please hit please hit great <laughs> Fantastic, that's one of the reasons I don't really use debuffs in any game other than 13 because in 13 debuffs are like balanced and they're like kind of intended so like You know they do reasonable amounts of like debuffing but in this I feel like they made it so that debuffs do like a lot but they just never fucking hit is the problem. I also didn't see how much that blizzard did to that one guy. Uh, but let's let's temper up our yub. Oh my god, dude! There we go. Hit him, yub. Oh Jesus. We're gonna have to take a, a turn to potion heal for a second. 
Get him, please. 31. Uh. Oh. Um, we're, yeah, I'm gonna potion heal, because potions get priority. Uh, I'll heal you up, too. I'm gonna try thundering the other one, see how that goes. And then I will... Potion... the white mage, I guess. Oh! No, I will not! Oh, this is gonna be rough. Well, it's gonna be rough getting out of here. Oh! You son of a bitch, you. There we go. Alright, they don't like lightning. Yes! Okay. Now I just have to get out of here. I got the crown. I'm taking it back, taking it back, back. Okay, I'm not gonna do it. You guys remember Brendan Uri? More like Brendan Ure Urethra. Nailed it. Killed it. So happy about that one. I'm wondering if- I don't think I should use my Phoenix down just yet. I think I can get out of here with just these guys, right? That's probably fine. Uh, let's save. We will drop a save, though. <laughs> with dead Fark over there. Farkin! This mother is dead. And yeah, it just sucks that, like, I know there's a lot of useful- not in there, but... In general, in this area, there's a lot of useful shit in these. And like, I want to go grab some of it, but like... I was already in there. But it's this big grid of like a shit ton of these rooms, and I forget what's in what. And I know one of these has more mind flayers in it. Oh, fuck these things! Oh, I may have to run from these. Um, because they are- they're only weak to magic. You can only hit them with magic. So like... Yeah. Please run, please- there we go, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna check this door and I'm gonna get out of here because... Okay. I don't wanna fuck with any more oozes. Oh, okay, that'll help, that'll help. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. I'm tired of this. I think one, one more, if you go down a little bit further, there's another one of these doors with fucking mind flayers in it, and I'm just, I'm not about it right now. More gargoyles. Oh man, every time. There's a, there's like a orchestra thing they did that you can listen to on YouTube for like the 20th anniversary or whatever, where it's a battle medley of every Final Fantasy battle theme. And like, it's insane how all of them are hits. Like, they're all bangers. Like, Final Fantasy has never missed on music. Die. Die. Is that a big nose he's got there? Or is that like a little... I don't know. The wings appear to be coming out of his neck. And he's got like a big nose and like bug eyes. I don't know. Some of these enemies are a little weird. Did I miss it? No, it's up here. Oh, please, no. Oh god, it's green slimes. We are fleeing. I do not care. Yee! Scooby-Doo running out of the fucking dungeon. No! Where is it? Here it is. I need the, I need the fucking Scooby-Doo running sound effect for every time I flee. See, like, this is... Uh, Please don't. As long as... As long as Shuriko doesn't get paralyzed. Okay. And I can magic... Magic the, the... The ghouls. Oh, fuck everything. Okay, well, we're running. If Peebus is able to run, we're running. Bro, you guys are assholes. Fuck you guys! Yeah, got it. Come on, Peebus. There we go. Oh my god. Am I gonna be able to get out of this fucking cave? These little rock barriers are so obnoxious, too. Like that. Because if this was Pokemon rules, I could walk behind that. Fuck off, I have to go down in the round. Down in the round town! Oh, what now? No more goblins. Goblin. Do I... I guess I'll fight him, huh? I love the casting animation from this game, too. The little hand waving in front of the face there. Peebus is charging his chakra. What jutsu will Peebus use? Dude, we've been watching too much Naruto recently. I hate that feeling of being back into Naruto. Especially because, like, I'm back in, but I'm, like, complaining the entire time. 
Because, like, Sakura is, like, a, a way worse character than I remember. Like, I remember picking Sakura in the games because she's cute and never, like, giving a shit about her in the show. But I always forgot about like, what, what, like, an actually awful person she is. Okay. Um. Uh. So I can Phoenix down somebody. Do I even need to? Fully resourced party members can only be used outdoors. Okay, so I guess we'll have to... But I also, I feel like I can get back. I feel like if I tent up, I can get back to town with just these two. I think that'll be okay. I really hope that'll be okay. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Okay. Who? Goblin. Suspenso. Okay. Actually, why don't I just try running from them as well? I just don't like running in this game because sometimes it fails and then you have to end up... Then you have to fight them at a disadvantage because you've already been hit. So if it's like a... Yeah, like if it's this, if it's just fucking Shrek and a couple of wormies, then like, I'll fight Shrek and the worms. I'll blizzard some worms, fire some worms, no problem. That's a dead worm. It's just those swarms of enemies I don't like. Especially something stronger like like uh, guard goblins. No more Mr. Nice Shrek. Alright. Oh, now the team's gonna be... Like, the levels are gonna be unbalanced. Damn it. Okay. I feel like I want to run from this one. <laughs> no. There we go. The Warriors of Light ran away like a bunch of pros. Like a bunch of real champs. It takes a lot of bravery to be a coward. What the fuck is that? Fucking werewolf? How about you fuck off? I want that thing dead. I want him de Oh, he didn't- he didn't have as much health as I thought he did. Goodbye, Scroblin. No more Mr. Nice Goblin. I'll, for like one second, I looked at like their pants, and they're like two-tone, where you can see they're kind of like blue on the back, but they're like almost the same color as their skin on the front. I'm like, are these goblins walking around like balls out? Are they actually Scroblins? Shit. More wolves. Uh, please. We're the Warriors of Light. We need help. We're dying. That'll be $200, please. Fuck. What about you, father? How much is this? Oh, $200 to raise the, the corpse of... Okay, cool. That's great. Look at these little babies. These little deadly premonition babies. Healing a Shurko. Yes, I would like to rescue Fark, please. Rise from your grave. Cool. Now that I've paid my uh, indulgences to the church to allow my friends to come back to life so that we can, you know, save the planet and shit, now I can pay another $100 to take a nap at this guy's inn. This is a world of scam artists. I do have 3,000 gold, though, so I could either buy a bunch of little things or I could buy one... Like, haste. <laughs> or whatever. God. Yeah, there's definitely going to have to be some... The problem is that if I if I grind off camera for, like, money, we're going to end up over-leveled. Which I guess wouldn't be the worst thing in the world, other than I know that, like, that bothers some people. But, I mean, if it allows me to not have to fight bosses multiple times, then uh, I think it'll be okay. Because, you know, we're in this for the scenery. And for the gl the glorious, incredible plot of this game. Everyone knows Final Fantasy is a series about plot. And this game is no different. In this game, there's a bunch of big monsters and you gotta kill them. It's crazy, I know. Uh, deal by damage. Yeah, I'll just get haste. Hmm...
Okay, wait, can another? No, oh, none of them can learn it. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, our our magic level is too low. Okay, never mind. So yeah, that's the thing with these is that there's like multiple different levels of magic around you can buy. So I'm not gonna be able to buy these either. Yeah. Shit. So yeah, maybe I do need to grind for levels a little bit. Because it just sucks having to go, like, we're already going to have to go back to Provoca to get those couple spells I left back there. But it sucks having to run back and forth across the fucking continent to buy spells you missed before. Like, equipment. Luckily, the equipment's, like, just flat better in every town, I think. And plus, like like I said, I don't know what we get in dungeons, so I'm probably not going to buy a whole lot of equipment. Um, but spells are like, you know, oh, there we go, see. We want Fyra. We want Thundara. And then... I will... I think I'll get Heal, actually. As my last purchase. For now. And then, yeah, I guess I'll run around and make some money. And, uh... And get the rest of what I need from here. Okay, so I did a little off-screen grinding. And, uh... As you can see, everybody's a little bit higher level than they were last time. Um, I bought some magic for these folks, so we have Heal, Diara, um, Cura, Poison, Poisona, Poisana, <laughs> and Vox for our Shirko. Uh, Vox, Cure, Silence, Damage, all done. yeah, you can see, you can see. Um, we got, uh, Fyra, Thundara, and Blizzara for Peebus, and Fark has No Blaze Hold, uh, which causes Paralysis, Confuse, and Haste. Don't know why Haste is black magic, I forgot about that, but that's cool, I guess. So, we have a bunch more magic, um, we have a little bit different equipment, we got, I found a battle axe for him, or I bought a battle axe for him, leather shield, leather cap, chainmail, leather gloves. Um, I could buy an iron shield for him, but I've been spending all my money on magic so far, so. Uh, Shirko got the hammer that Yub used to have, um, I found a dagger, I went back to, Ma to Marsh Cave, and really all I got in there was a dagger, um, and then the broadsword on Fark now, because, uh, yeah. Um... So, the other thing I remembered is that I can't- I'm gonna have to come back to Marsh Cave again later anyway, because, uh, I did- I did go to the inn, right? Yes, okay. Um, I'm gonna have to come back for Marsh Cave later because there's a bunch of- the last couple doors at the bottom. Oh, that's actually Shrek, wow. Ogre- Ogre Chief. I can't believe Shrek was so popular that the entire, uh, country of Scotland took over his accent. Is that right? I might have fucked that up. Anyway. Um, you need the Mystic Key for uh, the rest of Marsh Cave. And so I'm gonna have to come back for that later. I'm also gonna try to not use too much magic on my way up here because basically, if I remember the, the path here correctly, um, I'm on my way to a boss fight right now. Um, I have to make kind of a kind of a runabout here, a runaround, not a runabout, a runabout. I'll steal it. Um, but we have to go all the way up to, there's a, there's a little castle thingy up north. We have to go all the way up there, and then we have to go all the way back to, like, over to where Provoca is. We have to go north of that. And that's gonna be, like, that, that, it's just, like, it's not even that hard, it's just a fucking walk. Like, it's a real-ass walk. Um, and I guess I'll just fire to get these guys out of my face. Out of my face, idiots. Ooh. Yeah, dude. Yub is like... Yub's damage is like... Off the charts. I'm gonna have to get some new shots. Please die. Oh no, he's still alive. Fuck. I might skip my... I might skip myself ahead a little bit if I run into any more fucking ogres. They're so fat. But what's funny was when I went back to Marsh Cave, I, I had like... I ran into like no encounters the entire time I was in, the entire time I was in there. A tarantula. Oh god, fuck off. I always think it's funny when like I run into a single tarantula and it's just like the four warriors of light versus one spider. One spider, that's it. So this is the beauty of this now is that I can use uh, po poisona to cure up people uh, and I don't have to waste antidotes. But I do still have the antidotes in case uh fuck, I, I always forget. Um, in case I don't want to spend the magic. Like, I probably should have used an antidote there, but whatever. That would be fine. Oh, Christ. And antidote. I love that, that little animation for it, too. I also bought more potions. Fuck. 
I had like exactly 30 and then, oh, here's the, so I called it an asp before. Um, it's called a cobra in this version, but in the original game it was called an asp. And I'm like, that's a very specific snake. That's like uh, in Golden Axe, the villain is called Death Adder. And I remember being like, what, what the fuck is an adder? What is he, a goddamn mathematician? Who does this guy think he is? And then it turns out an adder is a type of snake, like a species of snake. And then I'm like, oh, that's stupid and specific, but all right. Imagine becoming like a like a big tough warlord supervillain Ganondorf motherfucker, and then you're like, I'm gonna name myself after this specific species of snake. Like, think of like a weird bug. That's gonna be my name. There's the castle, but between me and the castle are these fucking five wolves. There are five wolves inside of you. Sorry about that transporter malfunction, Captain. <laughs> that fucking picture's so stupid. Chief O'Brien's so stupid. Man, I'm gonna end up getting talking about Star Trek and this shit again. I almost named like half my party members after Star Trek characters. I was gonna have Cork and Spork, and then like I wanted to have like some kind of goofy nickname for like Bones, um, and then I was gonna just have Chekhov. Because Chekhov's goofy enough as it is. He doesn't need to be um, altered in any way. I'll just mash it tonight. It's fine. Mr. Spock? No more Mr. Nice Wolf. Why am I Why am I no more Mr. Nice today? No more Mr. Wife Guy. Alright, so we're in Western Keep. There's these fucking bats. They kiki key key when you talk to them and you can't push them around. But they kiki. Key key. Key key. What's the rest of that baby? Kiki. Oh my god, it's the king! <laughs> Mwahahaha. You fools fell right into my trap. I am Astos, king of the Dark Elves. Dark Elves not capitalized, am all capitalized. Am like Allied Master Computer? Hate. Hate. Eee, look at this fucking. <laughs> Ew, I don't like it. With the combined power of the crown you now hold and the crystal eye I already possess, I will become the true Elf King. But aren't you already the Dark Elf King? It is useless to resist me. I can take what is mine by sheer force. I'm well, sure you can, buddy. Oh my god, you look at him. I don't like how much his tail looks like. Never mind. Uh, so I'm going to smack him real quick. Also, I found out what exactly... Uh, oh god, what do I do? What do I do? I don't think he's technically undead, so I'm just gonna invis on Peebus. And then, uh... I wanna say he's weak to... F fire? Um, and then... I think he casts, too. I kinda wanna silence him, but I don't know for sure. You know what? I'll just, um... I'll temper up Yub, because that shit goes a long way. What is that? <gasps> Are you... <laughs> I don't think he's ever done that to me before. Look at his droopy little tits. What the fuck? Um, okay. Alright. Um, oh, okay. Well, good thing I saw this fucking phoenix down, huh? And now I'm invisible. Invisible. Anyway. Sorry. Um, I'm gonna hit Blizzard and see what it does. Um, 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 um. I guess I'll haste him for whenever he wakes up. Uh, what is that? Oh, that's slow, I think. Um, so, before when I when I suddenly had a dag... Oh, because he was... Man, fuck off. I thought items went first. Okay, that did enough. Alright, well. Um, earlier when I suddenly had a... Um, when I suddenly had a dagger in my hand, um, apparently the reason was because there's this equip screen down here where you can just change your equipment mid-battle. I don't know why. But like uh, you can, and when you're when you're using the speed up button, a lot of times it will like stop on the um, on the equip button, and so I accidentally switched items while I was uh, grinding. So that's cool. I'm gonna try Thundara. Since I don't remember what anything's weak to, I'm just like, um, I feel like I should just swing on him. I'm gonna try hold and see if that works. 
miss. I figured. Oh, he haste, hasted himself. Shit. Chop, chop. Um. Yeah. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeedy. It's a lot going on in my brain right now. Um. I'm gonna. No, it's not worth a general heal right now. I'm just gonna keep hitting Cura, Cura on him. Uh, and then... I want... Can I get Temper to go first, please? Ah. He's gonna end up dying before the Red Mage actually manages to, like, do anything. Like, this is probably gonna kill him, watch. <laughs> 84. Okay. So he was weaker to Blizzard, I guess. But he's dead anyway, it's fine. Wow, well, I've- yeah, I don't think- a Mithril Sword! Yes! Yes! Um, I don't think I've ever been deathed by him before. That's kind of fucking crazy. But now we have the Crystal Eye. Um, and this is kind of funny when I think about it, like, where we're gonna end up taking this. Um, but I don't think we can access anything else in here right now. I think we need the Mystic Key for everything else in this castle. I don't even know if there are enemies in here, actually. But I'll take a little look around. Um, the other thing that was funny was when I was in Marsh Cave, I, I went into... Yeah, Mystic Key. So I went into one of the rooms in Marsh Cave, and there was nothing in there. And so I left the room, and on my way to the door, I got ambushed by enemies. And um, there was a couple of skeletons, and there was an enemy called a Blood Bones. And it was just like a, a, like a black skeleton with a red sword. And it was kind of funny. 